Hey everybody, how's it going? JDK here, and I'm going to be playing some Binding of Isaac Rebirth again. Yes, I know. I usually play on file too, but I took some time off because I was kind of getting disheartened with my YouTube channel. Kind of getting annoyed of dying over and over again, and I got a lot of practice in, got some time to just think about how I'm going to run my channel from now on, and just move forward and everything but yeah as you see I've unlocked a lot of stuff in my first file and I'm just gonna play games on my first file now instead of playing on the second file and for the first time on this first file even though you know you didn't see me unlock a lot of stuff it's legitimately there I'm playing on a PS4 so I don't think there's really any way to cheat and now that I got some practice in it's gonna be more fun to watch but we're gonna do an Isaac run I just unlocked the D6 yesterday, so now I can reroll stuff, and I don't like that item. I don't really like the $3 bill either, but I'm probably going to have to take it. And of course, I get the one of these. Oops, I don't want to get hit there. Oh well. Got a spirit heart out of it anyway, and a troll bomb. Yeah, that sucks. That's okay these flies off but yeah for my last video that I put on YouTube I got kind of frustrated and I decided to take a time some time off from Isaac at least recording Isaac because it was just getting on my nerves having to commentate and play the game when I'm severely out of practice now I think I'm back in the swing of things I mean I beat Isaac and the loss with blue baby so I should be able to have at least semi-successful runs, you know? Like I said in other videos, it is harder to play while commenting, but I'm going to continue to do it. I've been playing a lot of that Star Wars Battlefront beta lately, and I'm going to be having a review of that up too soon, hopefully, or, or, or an impressions video, not really a, a full review because it's not a full game. You can't really review a beta. I just hope my microphone is up loud enough because I don't know what this key is. Okay, it's a good or a good pill, not a key. I just hope my microphone's up loud enough right now so everyone can hear me in the VOD, because if not, that's gonna be really frustrating. I hope that I can get these guys killed before they get to me. I have to turn my volume down because I have the air conditioner on right now and it'll pick up that noise if I don't. I'd rather have Oh damn it, I don't want to get hit there. I'd rather have a quiet voice than white noise, you know? I don't like the white noise in the video. I have some videos up where I have some pretty bad white noise and it just doesn't sound good. And I think my voice peaks a lot in the videos anyway, so it doesn't really matter if I have the microphone down a little bit. I'm really close to the microphone right now, so hopefully it all works out in the long run. But anyway, the Battlefront pretty fun. I'm, I'm probably not going to buy it when it comes out because, damn it, I need to focus here. I'm not going to talk while I'm fighting this boss. It's too tough. This pattern I don't really like. I'm better at him now though, that's for sure. I just want to clear out these little dingles. You don't get hit this many times. It's terrible. Luckily, it doesn't matter if I lose right heart damage here or not because. This sucks. Because it's the first floor. I don't have to worry about getting to deal with the devil or not. Man, he got, he's way too tanky to be a first first floor boss, like, this is a terrible first floor boss, it's the worst one to fight, no, actually the gurglings are, but, it's fucking annoying, <laughs> I don't want to start this video off complaining about everything, because I love this video game, it's fun to play, but, shit like that annoys me in the game, and I'm not going to be able to re-roll $3 bill, but that's okay, I got tears up from that boss fight, pretty good one. And a $3 bill. Which, I mean, isn't the worst. It isn't really that bad. There is a lot of good things. But look at that. I wouldn't want that. And I hate this. 
Actually, I think that's Fear Shot, but the one that explodes, Fire Mind, that's a terrible item. I, I was playing it the other day trying to get the D6 unlocked with Blue Baby, and I got like four runs in a row with Fire Mind, and I just can't stand it. Because it just kept killing me, you know? Because it, it, it never exploded, like, when you're far away from an enemy like that, and there's an enemy across the room. Oh, it's not going to blow up. But once you get up to an enemy, say the enemy's right here at the wall, and you're hitting them, then it'll explode over and over again and kill you. Oh, you're speaking of it? Let's find out. Let's give it an example here. Maybe it'll... Yeah, see that? The closer they were to me, the more it exploded. But I've gotten used to it a little bit. I had a chocolate milk... Fire Mind, Proptosis, and a bunch of other like crazy. I don't want that. Even though it gives me five bombs, it's not worth it. But a bunch of other crazy damage upgrades. But with the chocolate milk, it, it really sucked. But pressing it over and over again, tapping the button, made it work a lot better. And I would like to have a Spirit Heart before going into this boss fight. Because I'm probably going to take damage. Let's find out what a reroll for this is. Oh my god. I don't want it. I'm not taking it. It's not worth it. It, it just causes damage more often than not. <laughs> the, the, the one item I complain about. And I, there's my right heart damage. It doesn't matter. Because if I take take red heart damage on the second floor and don't get my deal with the devil hopefully i won't take red heart damage on the third floor and get deal with the devil then either way you know it doesn't really matter if it's the third floor or the second floor i get a deal with the devil because if i get one on the second floor i won't get one on the third floor most likely i do like this tear effect oh shit i'm playing sloppy it is late at night looking over at my chat. I have my projector up with the chat, the Twitch chat going, and nobody's in the room yet. That's okay. I didn't figure many people would show up just like usual. I didn't really announce it. I don't have a schedule when it comes to streaming, so that definitely doesn't help my view count when it comes to things. Not to mention that not really a lot of people watch me play anyway. <laughs> so if you are watching, this is a VOD. I appreciate it. It's cool. I'm glad you're, hopefully you're enjoying yourself. Watching me get annoyed and take tons of Fred Heart damage. Play, playing extra sloppy, you know. Hopefully I won't die in the first half of the game like I have in a lot of my other videos. Fuck you. Let's kill him. There we go. I found a one Red Heart. This is, this is sad. Like, really. Like, they, they're just giving me the hardest rooms possible, it seems like. But I got plenty of money. That's a, oh, fuck you, man. Come on. Don't die on the first, second floor. It's ridiculous if you do. If I do, I'm just going to start over. I should just start over anyway. This is a terrible run. I can't believe I'm down to one red heart. It's fucking awful. And it's a worthless room. Uh, there could be a secret room here. I'll try it. Yes, it is. And something I totally don't care about. But I could go to the shop, use the last bomb. Give it a coin if I need it. Okay. I do want the nun's habit. Or the habit. But I'd like that spirit heart as well. And the spirit heart just seems a little more important to me right now. I don't have any more bombs. I don't have any more rerolls. And I won't have another reroll. So it's either fire mind or nothing. And... Nothing actually kind of sounds good compared to Fire Mind right now, but I'm going to take it because it is a damage upgrade. Well, it isn't it. exactly a damage upgrade, but it does increase damage. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to game over here. Ex the explosions do a lot of damage, you know? Oh, sucker. A lot of swearing has been going on while I play Isaac. That's okay, though. Just die. Just explode. It's gonna wait until, you know, it gets real close to me to explode, though. Okay, well. What is that? Magic scab. HP and luck up. Hey, HP up's okay with me. And I do have half the spirit heart that I can hopefully save until the next floor. I would like the habit a lot. Especially synergizing with the D6, but... 
That's not gonna happen, it looks like. No, I don't have any bombs. We'll use the world card as soon as we get to this next floor. Oh, I have a curse that I can't see the map anyway, so never mind. That's stupid. Can't use it. Alright. This is a cool item. It just always fucks me over. Like, it'll wait till it flies right next to me. And it hasn't been an example for it yet in this run. Watch it just totally makes me eat my words and so it never happens in this run. Hey, if it doesn't happen, I'm happy because it's happened a lot to me. Or maybe I'm just used to the item enough now that it ain't gonna happen. I won't let enemies get close enough to me to do it. Okay, these guys are gonna blast little tears everywhere and then creep out. Okay, cool. Closer to full health. I would like the wub worm or whatever, the pulse worm. Wub wub. <laughs> but uh, I'm not gonna waste my time trying to get it. If I could fly, I'd go right over there, but I can't fly. I wonder if the explosion ratio is affected by your luck stat, is what I want to know. Like, the explosions from Firemind happen more often, the more luck you have. I want to try to find this item room soon, so I can, uh, there we go, that was a good explosion. But so I can, I want you to find the item room soon so I can use my D6 if I have to. And I have a feeling that it's over here. Oh god, this room. When you don't have much damage, it sucks. But Firemine works pretty good with these guys because once they go into the slime state, they, uh, the fire will kill them off. There, and hey, look at, there was the item. There, there is the item room right there. My intuition paid off. And I have two keys, so I can go into the shop as well. And full health now. And I have enough money to buy something from the shop. Oh, Rainbow Baby is exactly what I don't want. But, oh, yeah, I definitely don't like my reflection with Pyro <laughs> or Fire Mind. Mutant Spider, though, fantastic. Lower tiers, but quad shot, definitely want that. And the battery's tight, but, uh... I need, I need the spirit heart. I can't take right heart damage. I want to get to the boss. I want to get my deal with the devil. But if I can find three more cents before the boss, that I, I can't have a bomb. That'd be amazing because um, then I'd have another charge for my D6. Okay. There's the de there is the deal with the devil. Or not the deal with the devil, the boss. I'm going to try to find three more cents first. It might not be a possibility. We'll find out. I already went up there. That's the, that is the, the shop. I have a uh, D6 charge. Ooh, Death Touch. Nice. Uh, a D6 charge uh, for the boss fight will allow me to redeal, roll my deal with the devil. See, these guys are fast. If I shot them with Fire Mine, they might have uh, exploded and hit me. I don't want that. And this guy's tanky. Oh, there we go. There's my D6 charge. And some bombs. I get, uh, could go to that gold chest, but I don't think it'll be worth it. And there, I've been through the whole floor, I believe. There might be a few rooms missing, but all the important rooms are... Got, I got them. There's two cents there. I like that battery, but I don't know if... I'm, I'm going to fight the boss first. That's what we'll do first. And, yeah, I'd rather have the spirit heart than anything else. I'm not going to take that until after the boss fight. Okay, it should be relatively easy. Just let me concentrate here. I don't want to take any damage. I shouldn't take any damage from Chubb. Chubb's a simple boss. Especially with the... Fire Mine's wrecking him, though, by the way. And the Quad Shot. Quad Shot's amazing. Caffeine, Phil. Um, I might re-roll that if the deal with the devil is good enough. Okay, there's Spirit of the Night. I do want, because flying is awesome. Oh, and Bum Friend, yeah. That's what I'll take. Definitely worth it there. And, hmm, if I can buy 
Because that's just a speed upgrade, I believe, isn't it? A speed, and you... I don't remember what caffeine pill does. It makes you smaller and speed upgrade. Let's find out what this is. the Kinesis. Useless. I can get two cents for sure. Right here. Maybe I'll get a spirit heart here too. Sweet two spirit hearts. That's amazing. See, this run is looking fantastic. And if I blow this up, I should have enough money to get that battery. And there we go. And there's another reroll for me. I think this fills me up. Yeah, it does. Okay. I like the 9 volt. I, it was really useful in uh, Vanilla Isaac. If I had a key, I'd get that. There's a world on the next floor. And we'll reroll that. Uh, that's a damage up, isn't it? Speed and damage. Yeah, way better. Okay. Now this this run is balling already, man. Yeah, and if you're watching my series before and you're disappointed that I'm not going back to file 2 to keep up with the runs and as they go. I should have recorded all my other runs too, but just doing the commentary is a lot of work for me. <laughs> like my brain doesn't work good enough, I guess, to leave commentary and uh, play the game at the same time. So I'm sorry if you're disappointed for that. I, I mean, if I get enough responses with people telling me, hey, go back and play that, I will. I'll go back and play my file too, but I think I'd rather, people would rather be more entertained with seeing it, seeing that I have made progress in the game, you know? I could go back and, you know, unlock everything again on file two. Just might as well pick this up. I only have two chargers, but why do it if I already have it unlocked on this, you know? Oh, and Guppy's paw, baby. I'll pick it up. I'm not, I'm not gonna use it on the one, even though it would give me free spirit hearts, I'm not gonna use it on the one heart that I have because uh, I have enough spirit hearts and I can use that for a deal with the devil. And yes, I got three more spirit hearts now. I'll just use the world card. Oh, I wish I could go in the secret room directly from here. Oh, I don't have the bomb anyway, never mind. Let's go. Yeah, that's great. Fantastic damage. Perfect amount of damage for this far in the game. Actually, better damage than what I probably should be at at this part of the game. There's the bomb. I did pick up a bomb somewhere, I guess. I need a key now. That's what I really need. But I'll go to the boss fight and see. Oh, there is a... But yeah, I'll go to the boss fight and see what's up. Oh, I hate this. That is a bad tier effect to have. You have to get close to the enemies, and I don't want to blow up or blow myself up. Okay, pick up that red heart and spit me out spirit heart. See, I'm already max, almost max spirit hearts. That's awesome. Blow up you. Oop, almost got hit there. There's a key I could use, but I'm gonna go in here. A familiar, like a demon baby, would work pretty good right now. I should have picked him up. Uh, but Demon Baby is better, you know, familiar, so when, with, like, Demon Baby would be good for, uh, when enemies get close to me that, and I don't want to blow, you know, accidentally blow myself up. I can just let Demon Baby take, take over. Demon Baby? Demon Beggar? What, 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 what's his name? I don't remember. The one that, that shoots the, he shoots, uh, rapid fire, uh, red tears. He's cool. Stay on one side at a time. Wait for him to fire at me. Hopefully not blow myself up. Oh, damn it. I keep doing that. This pattern's so easy, too. I don't know why I get hit by him. Just not being careful is what it is. There we go. Super easy. Took him out quick. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. All stats up, even though... I thought it slowed you down, but I guess it doesn't. It feels like I'm faster now. Hmm. Anyways, I was talking about the battle <laughs> beta like uh, two floors ago. Fuck, I don't know what this does. I haven't picked this up before. Midas Hedge. Oh, 
That's awesome. I, I like this item, but it really doesn't work well with what I have right now. But anyway, the Battlefront beta, and then I got sidetracked fighting um, a stupid poop boss. I forget his name. Dingle. And I stopped talking about it, but yeah, that, it's pretty fun. It has really bad balancing issues, but it's awesome. It's going to run until tomorrow. I, I, by the time this uh, video is up on YouTube, it'll probably be tomorrow. So t tomorrow's going to be the day that you're watching this. If you're watching this the day it comes, I put it on, post it on YouTube. Oh, it's going to be the last day that you're going to be able to play the Battlefield beta. So check it out if you can. And if you missed out... Well, the game comes out like no, but oh fuck! See, that's what I don't like. It's got, the game's coming out like November fifteenth or something like that. I probably won't buy it because it's multiplayer only. It isn't gonna have a single player campaign. But I do. I, I think I got like all the fun I'm gonna have out of it with the <laughs> the beta. The most the map I was most you know looking forward to was the Hoth map, and it's it's pretty cool. The balancing issues though were pretty bad because it's really hard to be the rebels. Oh, there's not another key or a way for me to remove red hearts so I can go into that boss trap room. There's, there's a hematomesis in here. Nope. Let's just go there. Uh, I will waste another bomb there. Whatever. Whatever. Let's go. I got plenty of spirit hearts for me to run my next or get my next deal with the devil, hopefully. I think I have a 75% chance to get a deal with the devil on this floor. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go in here. Boom. Goat head. Oh, uh, well. Hey, I have a 100% chance of getting a deal with the devil now. Even if I take right heart damage. Pick that up. Demon baby. Yeah, oh. Oh, that's a good spider. I hate when I go to fight, go into shoal and... He just drops bad spiders all the time. So, that's really annoying. I'm almost fought, I've almost fought it was enough, I think, to, uh... Oh, I don't have a key. To unlock the Polaroid so I can start fighting Blue Baby. And I want to be able to do that. I still haven't fought Mega Satan either. Well, there's that. I just need a key. Mega Satan, I want to get that done. Ooh. What's good about having Fire Mind with Spirit of the Night, I can shoot through rocks. I don't have to worry about getting too close to enemies that as much as I was before. And this is a tinted rock, right? No, that's not a tinted rock. What is this? Speed up. Okay, I'm really fast now. I like, I actually, the faster I am in Rebirth, the better. I, I feel like I have more control when I'm the faster I am. Slow, slow characters just annoy me. Uh, Bomb things, come on. There we go, there's that key. I'm definitely not going to make it to boss rush, I don't think. Depths one. Unless I, like, oh, why did I do that? That's, that is one downside of having too much speed. Speed kills. Yeah, that sucked. That's whatever, though. I'll probably find another key. How does that work? Okay, that's stupid. What was I just saying? Oh, boss rush. Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. Unless I can beat this floor and the next floor in like nine minutes. I don't think it's gonna happen though. What's this? Bad spiders. Fucking, are you wizard so stupid? Let's see over here. We're safe. Like for one of these to blow up and blow up some skulls, just in case I can get some black hearts out of it. Let's give myself, there's a black heart. Okay, and I can't get trapped in the corner with these guys coming at me because I don't want to blow myself up. That sucks. I've lost that one key. That's okay though. I think I probably have enough damage to win the game at this point, as long as I don't play too sloppy. There's another key. I'm gonna fight the boss before I go back. Too hard of a boss. People say it's a hard boss, but if you have good damage, it's not hard at all. Oh, 
try and gain HP from this boss fight without even an HP up, you know, because I have that black heart up there. Try to be crushed. The Emperor. I will take Torn Photo. Torn Photo's good. You get that. Not gonna drop anything. Strength's good. I'll pop Strength because I just want to fuck Krampus up with quickness. And, oh, there was a black heart. That sucks. Lump of Coal is better. I'll keep Lump of Coal. I'm not gonna reroll it either. I did get a key, so I uh, will oh, get this Emperor card. I'll run back here. That might be my secret room. Yes, it is. Hematomesis. There is no. Well, there might be something that requires me to have one red heart. Ooh, health down. I didn't want that. But that's okay. I'll use another hematomesis, and you will drop more spirit hearts for me. I know you will. Two of them. Three of them. Oh, I don't need two of three of them. Two of them was fine, buddy. Let's go find out what's in the item room. I know I didn't use my rerolls properly, but that's okay. I have a really strong run already. I don't have to worry about... Oh, yeah. Poop. Box of spiders is better than poop, but... Poop butt. But it's not... Uh, it's still not good. I don't have a battery charge anywhere, so... Maybe this way... Oh, I don't have another key. That sucks. I didn't have a battery anywhere, did I? I don't believe so. I only have one more... Ooh, I didn't use this. So I didn't fight this, did I? No, there might be a battery in here. Use all my little options. Probably should have just hurried and tried to get boss rush. I might be able to get boss rush. But I don't know if I'm strong enough to fight in boss rush. Boss rush. Running out of ways to talk here. Ooh, there we go. There's a bomb. I didn't get a key though. That sucks. A key would have been nice just in case I could have got a battery charge in the shop. And it's just a red heart, which you didn't even drop anything for me. It doesn't matter if you did or not. There's no. There's nothing in there. Let's see if I can get something out of here by just running over it once. Twice. Nope, that's all I'm going to do. I'm not going to run over it three times. It's not worth three spirit hearts. I only did it because I had a spirit heart here. It's here, though. And just spiders. Yep, not worth it. No tender rocks in here. Oh, that was just Krampus. Yep, yeah, let's go on to the next floor. If I can beat it in five minutes, I can get the boss rush. Arcade. Um, go in there and look at it. I will take this penny back and use this one time. Get a penny. Just so down, down to a half heart interval. I don't really know exactly what that'll do for me, but it doesn't matter. Uh, bomb. And I still have 15 cents to... Oh yeah, death touch. Awesome. Go into the shop if I can. Since I already have my key here, I'm going to go in here. Oh, that wasn't even a shop. It was... It was a library. Found all the secrets. Okay, there's that. I will re-roll those if I can. That was super easy. It's super easy to kill these guys. Kill them off. And there's my spirit heart. That maximum capacity. I hope my, my voice isn't too low on this recording. It probably is, though. Whatever. And there's... Oh, fuck. Just don't stop. <laughs> First damage I've taken in a while. And uh, juicy sack. Daddy Long Legs. Oh yeah, Daddy Long Legs is great. Juicy sack has a little jizz puddle around it. Let's run through there quick. Right, you guys, no problem. I still don't want to get blown up. Really, you're not dead. All right. Guppy would be great to have. Um, should I re-roll re those? I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna get enough re-rolls to go through the entire library. Uh, or you know, this, the options the library has. So there's no reason to waste the re-rolls on it. I'll waste them for. I won't waste them, but I'll use them on my uh, boss fight, possibly or. Uh, Oh, 
for it a little bit. Damn it, I ran into her anyway. We'll use it for the boss fight or the deal with the devil. That's what I was trying to say. Oh, and she dropped. Oh, here she is. Death Touch was a great item, or a great tier effect to have. Ooh, I almost, I hurt myself, but I almost got, almost, uh, did more than hurt myself there. I don't want more pill room. There's no reason I have more pill room. The shadow from uh, Daddy Longlegs threw me off. I could reroll here and probably get another reroll before the boss fight. You know what? I'm going to. Ugh. Whatever. Nothing good, but nothing. It's not the worst item, I guess. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have attacked that close to that guy, but I was like, eh, he's going to drop a bomb, so I might as well. If it hits me, the bomb's either going to hit me or I'm going to hit myself, so let's figure it out. Let's do it. I don't like these guys either. They're a little, I don't know what they are, hangman. Uh, those skulls are worth blowing up. I don't see any tented rocks there. Oh, really, man? I didn't get my reroll. Okay, whatever. Oop, and I run into that instead. Okay, if I go back and fight that mid boss, or sub boss, whatever the hell it's called, mini boss, and do my trap room, then I'll have enough. If I have enough, I'll have uh, my D6 charge. There we go. Oh, I was not expecting him to spawn right there, even though I should have known. I took a lot of damage in this uh, floor. I'm going to use this as a teleporter. Oh, wait. Oh, man. I have to hurry. I can beat this fast enough. I can get to... Uh... Okay. Let's just get this done. Come on. Come on, pick those up. Pick them up. Pick them up. I have a minute to fight Mom. I don't think it's going to happen. But let's hurry and find out if I can. If I can beat Mom in a minute, I can go to Boss Rush and teleport out. Wait, no. I can't. What am I thinking? You have to have under 20 minutes. What the fuck? Not 20, not 30 minutes. I don't know what I was thinking. Boss Rush was 20 minutes, dude. Not 30. You're way, way, way too slow to get Boss Rush. So there's no reason to hurry. Take your time at this point. Oop, blowing myself up. <laughs> wow, what a I have had boss rush before. There we go. And we'll take that. Might as well fight. Oh, somebody just spammed my channel. How's it going? A bunch of crazy uh, spam talk. I don't want that. Ooh, ooh I kind of want brimstone. Oh, but I kind of don't. But I kind of do. And uh, I'm going to take it. Brimstone it is. And what were these? Unknown pills. 48 hour energy. Well, it don't matter if I uh, re-roll this or not because I can't take it. Oh, wait. I can re-roll it and it'll turn into... Yeah, there we go. I'll re-roll it again because I don't want that. And I don't want that, so whatever. I forgot, yeah, if you re-roll it, it'll also let you use your spirit hearts. But I didn't want either of those items. Neither of them are worth the three spirit hearts to me right now. Because I'm going to probably take a lot of damage here. How fast do I... Uh, I don't charge very fast at all, but... I'm going to do a shit ton of damage. Get that. Give me, give me a spirit heart, buddy. Nope. Oh yeah, baby. Tons of damage. Classicists are kind of tanky, I guess. Ooh, I wish I had this synergy forever. That's a that's an awesome synergy. It even looks awesome. My uh, gamma is pretty high right now. I should probably lower it a little bit. I am gonna lower it. Hold on one second. It's just hard to see the creep sometimes when the gamma's lower or wait, not creep uh, it's when you go have a curse of darkness and it's really hard to see and uh, I don't like that let's 
just clear this now. Yeah, brimstone, definitely worth it. Oh, and there's another spam message. If I had someone to moderate, I'd just ban that person right now. I know you can't see it in the VOD, but I can see it. And let's re-roll that. Uh, Book of Shadows, not worth it. I will re-roll it if I get enough rooms to re-roll it before the boss, but that's the only way I'm going to. I don't know if a Fire Mind and Brimstone work together. I haven't had any explosions happen, so if not, that's awesome. It's one way to cancel out that piece of shit item. Give me red hearts to give me more spirit hearts. That's okay. I'm definitely powering up full enough to fight Satan as long as I can keep my spirit hearts going well. You know, not take damage. And I can reroll that item again. Might as well. Only thing that's going to hit me now is like cheap enemies or my own stupidity. Taking dumb damage. And how long has this run been? Over a half hour already. Uh, yeah, I don't want that either. It's not worth fighting the enemies for, at least. It's just a speed upgrade, I think. Speed and range. I don't need speed or range. I have unlimited range, and I'm really fast right now. Oh, there's some red hearts for me. To oh, that wasn't a bad spider, at least. Okay, I have a weird feeling that... Well, the only way I can go is up, so I thought maybe that was going to be it, but it is it. Tons of hearts. If you can give me... You sucker. If you can give me more spirit hearts, I'd be eternally grateful. Well, there, there's one. That's good. Gurglings can't stand a chance against that brimstone. And fuck them up quickly, too. What's this? Pretty fly. Can't be a health town. Um, yeah, I'll just do it. Yeah, that was quick. I was hoping I could make it from one side of the room to the next. You go ahead and pick that up, buddy. I will take this so I can get my deal with the devil. And it's a guppy item. I wish I had the reroll, man. I wish I saved that reroll because I might have been able to turn in the guppy here. I'm not going to keep it. Is there a way to get that reroll? Yeah, there is. I can go pick up. Because I have a goat's head that, that deal with the devil will stay open for me. And I can go pick up whatever the shot is. Some type of crappy speed upgrade. And fight the enemies here. Really great speed on that. Uh, Yeah, well, this is super easy, so I don't have much to worry about. And I can re-roll this item, or the guppy head, and maybe get another guppy item and become guppy. I don't think I became guppy yet, have I? No, I've only had guppy's paw and guppy's head so far. Oh, I thought, <laughs> every time I run into the boss room, I think I'm going to be running into, uh... Excuse me one second. I think I'm running into the next floor. Uh, Book of Sin. Eh, it's whatever. What did it give me? Health up. I think that was a health down, but we'll have it. I'm not going to have any more, um, any more deals with devils, but it's whatever. I was missing a spirit heart anyway. There might be something in here. No, there, actually, yeah, there's not going to be anything for me to use that on. Uh, I should just go and fight the boss, huh? Yeah, I'll just use it. Oh, so close to beating him real quickly. Oops, I took damage instead. Get that. Now I'm gonna go down to Shoal. Almost everything here should take only one hit. It. Super greed got fucked up. in here. Not worth it. No, don't want to get blown up by you guys. Am I guppy? No, those are just still my leftover flies that I had from... Oh, I didn't want to pick that up, damn it. Whatever. Hey. 
Did I get, gain anything from that room? <laughs> but I didn't lose anything, at least. I got my re-roll on for the next floor. Big old fountains of piss spewing out of Isaac's mouth. Pick that up. Pick that up, Dark Thumb. Oh, and he did give me a spirit heart for once down here. Oh, I cut off my brimstone laser before I took him out. Seems like he had more life. They had more life than uh, Super Super Greed. I don't know if this is where the boss is gonna be. Nope. Oh, there's like a weird, crazy creaking sound on top of my roof just then. Probably a cat or a squirrel or something. Kind of startled me. Halloween season's in effect. Everyone should be creeped out, right? That's how it's supposed to work. What's this? Two bombs. I uploaded a splatter house. Let's look at also. And um, I'm trying to hopefully make more uh, Halloween-based games for the season while it's still October. You know, I'm gonna look at a few more games at least. Now that I'm back into the swing of things, I'm going to start recording more videos, releasing more videos. I was just kind of disheartened for a while. I, didn't, I haven't had many new followers. I'm almost halfway to 500. Once I get to 500, I'm going to have a custom URL, and that's going to help me out a lot. It'll make me feel a lot better about my YouTube channel. I'm going to use this guy. Why not? Um, yeah, if, once I can start advertising my YouTube channel like with a real URL, not like my username URL crap, it'll it, it'll it'll make me feel better at least. I'm just gonna re-roll this. I'll just contact this tight. And hopefully I'll get there sooner than later. I'm, I'm almost halfway. Right I have 229 subscribers, which is pretty good for you know mostly having a channel that's been inactive. I knew I was going to take damage. I'm going to take too much damage on him, though. Yeah, yeah took him out. That was quick. Only took one hit of damage from that super fast... Let's see if he'll just drop the spirit art here. That super fast shot that he does at the beginning of his first transformation. There we go. But hopefully this channel will pick up. I, I don't see it ever being like a main source of income for me. I don't want it to be really. I don't want this to be like a job. I want to do this for fun and I want to have some people watching me. And I'd like to, you know, meet new people mostly by playing the YouTube on the YouTube channel. Like find other players and we can, you know, play online together or etc. Because I'm not really into the whole online scene. I never have been much into the um, playing online with other people. Like, like I said in the other videos, like, the last time I played any games online was, like, the original Counter-Strike when I was in high school. Not even Global Offensive. And I'm trying to get into it more. It'd be fun to, like, start some sort of, like, streaming show with other people. That's good. But, like, watching Northern Lion, like, his channel grow from nothing to, you know, having a huge following has inspired me a lot. And, and I've always wanted to do something like that ever since I watched like his very first stream ever. I've been following him since the beginning. He was getting drunk and playing bad Super Nintendo games on an emulator on Justin TV and like seeing that back then like I was like this is cool I want to do this and then I just never had a computer that would be capable, was capable of doing it and I'm not as much I'm not as charismatic as him I should say as well so I, I I think it's awesome for him, you know, and like, I wish I could do it, and I, this is basically what I'm trying to do, just make some, have some little following, you know, some type of income supplementation, and just do what I like to do, and be able to talk to people. But yeah, he didn't have any followers, and now he's huge, he has like half a million subscribers, which is awesome for him. I didn't know that he'd do that, he posted on Reddit, on like, the gaming subreddit, that he was going to have a stream live, you know, I'm like, oh, that's kind of cool, and I think he was still in Korea then, and, like, I think there was 24 other people watching, and now he's huge, like, one of the most, probably the most popular, uh, Let's Player of Binding of Isaac, and I remember his very first Binding of Isaac episode was cool, too, like, I don't know how many views I got, but he, he blew up after that, you know, and he put a lot of hard work into his channel, 
I'm gonna have to do that too if I want out any sort of a uh, fan base. Even though it's harder to do it nowadays because there's so many people doing Let's Plays on YouTube. I'm just gonna stick to it. And how I tried to have a video every day, I don't think it's gonna happen. I just have too much life in the way to be able to release a video every single day. Anyway, back to the game here. Let's uh, get these guys' ass. And we're almost to the lamb. I think I called earlier when I was talking about fighting the lamb as Wu Baby, I said the lost. I meant the lamb. Who's actually really a really easy boss. Um, I don't know what that does. Oh, triple shot. Triple shot plus quad shot? Okay. I have picked this up before though. I thought I never picked it up before. I would I would have re-rolled it if I realized what it was. Oop. You know what? I don't think I picked this up. Bob's Curse. I've never picked that up on this uh, file yet. And here is the lamb fight, but I'm going to go fight all, everyone else just in case I can get more items. And will you drop the spirit heart? Yes, you will. Uh, the more items I can unlock, the better, you know? The closer I get to Platinum God. I'd like to get to Platinum God before the release of Afterbirth, but it ain't gonna happen. It might, uh, maybe before the release of Afterbirth on the PS4, because it's coming out later. Unless I, you know, I play this all day, every day. I'm not gonna be able to do that. Oh, come on. Of course, they give me this curse on the last floor of the game. These are nice and tanky uh, monster twos here. A lot of life. And they did, nobody's dropping any all right, more any more chests, of course. Let's go in here. Super bomb dude, whatever his name is. <laughs> what what is this one? I don't remember. And Mr. Mega I have picked up before. Stigmata I picked up before too, but it's a damage upgrade and I'll pick it up. And this is anemic, I picked that up as well. But I don't have any more rerolls possible. So it doesn't matter. Let me do that well. Secret room. Secret room. Yep. I'm not gonna try anymore. I'm just gonna fight the boss. Yeah. Taking him out quick. Oops. I thought I had my charge here. Have the best. Synergy too. Yeah, that was so fast. Oh, well, that was that run. Yeah. Uh, kicked its butt. I'm just gonna skip that ending because it does get louder than my voice. I've had some complaints on that. Anyways, that was another run with Binding of Isaac, and I actually won that time. Many thanks, many many thanks, many thanks to the D6 being unlocked for me. Yeah, if uh, you enjoyed, I'm gonna be playing more Isaac and. I have a new outlook on the videos, so if you've seen other videos in the past and I just complained the whole time, this is how it's going to be like from now on, hopefully, now that i got some good practice in. So yeah, if you enjoyed, uh, I'd appreciate it if you hit that like button, it'll help me out. It'll make me my presence stronger <laughs> on YouTube, and that'll get me more subscribers, and the more subscribers I have, it'll get closer to that 500 subscri subscription goal. So if you want to see more videos, subscribe. Um, now that I'm done spamming my website <laughs> or, or spamming my YouTube, uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully we'll see you next time.